Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. That'd be the military. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was uh, brave. Oh, That's right. Die. Ah, yes. Ah. Uh, was he the one bitten? Was he the one bitten? No. Don't be crazy. <laughs> it's his heart. My pills. It's just as bad. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes. We're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter. Oh, no, you want our help. How does he know this stuff? We'll do it somehow. We'll get in there somehow. Thank you so much. I don't like you, though. We need nitroglycerin pills. You're too Please moody. get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Better keep Everyone on else dad. should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? Nothing is, though. We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. Mm, yeah, that'd be great. Yeah, that'd be great. Do it. Well, it's got to get done. Plus, I'm quick, and I know me. Yep. Local? I trust you. Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie so you know to get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. He is Keep a, a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Didn't even okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Oh, demoted. Okay, let's examine the newspapers. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Well, you, you were a convict. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work though. Here, let me have a look. It's gonna be something stupid, I just know it. Okay. Hmm. Power? Nope, it's broken. Nothing. Volume? Nope. Must be broken. Check the back. Nope. That's Couldn't figure it out. God huh? damn it! Uh, What's it done? Let me examine it again. It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me, Let me take a look. look at that thing. Go ahead. Okay, let's try this again. I think it's took the back. It's gonna be something silly like no batteries or some shizzle whizzle. Flip it, there we go. Okay. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? Yeah, no, uh, there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. No. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Batteries. Noob. You're a pretty good shot. Thought you are. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter. Especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. A reporter, eh? You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me. <coughs> oh. And I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. Be happy. He said she was an asshole, but you know. Yeah. Most of them are. So he saved you, eh? That guy saved you? Yeah. Can you believe it? Those creeps or, or ghouls or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kinda cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Huh? Huh? Oh, nothing. Ooh. Ooh. How Gossip. You end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. Um, I'm looking I'm for those batteries. For batteries for that day. Thanks. I appreciate it. Yep. Okay. I better get back to it. You are yep. no longer useful. Dork. I mean, Doug. How are you? Heard or seen anything? How be you? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? 
I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. Oh. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. That's huh. daring. <laughs> uh, let's do it. Sure. Go have a look around. Cool. Gonna die. And <laughs> we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. Okay. Agreed. I agree. Stay silent. Shh, audience. Shh. Keep quiet. Keep very quiet. God damn. They can be they just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. And if one gets you, no different than people, you. really. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. Sounds like today's society, really. Yeah, and all this thing. I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Try a year. Yeah, I'm giving it a so year. Too. We better keep it down out of here. Yeah. Um, take the brick. I can't reach that brick. I sure as hell could. Trap walker. Look at the one trapped over there. Better hammer that huh? The manager of the pharmacy. Oh what? shit! What? What? Do you know that guy? Uh, kind of. Yeah. Kind of. He has a familiar face. Uh, you're from around here, huh? Could be anybody, you know. And they start rotting and get all chewed up. Oh, shut, shut up! up Lee, you're on the same page as I. Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. But worth it. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. Fine. I'll see what I can find. Uh, TVs. <laughs> Too bad we don't have a way to come out here and watch the news. Would be nice to know what's going on elsewhere. Atlanta's in rough shape. Could That's be a distraction, more like. Okay, so we can't do anything there, nothing there, nothing there, nothing there. Ooh. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around up. <laughs> oh. So some of these guys might have guns, maybe? It's a combination lock. Okay, open it. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Fine. Let's go back inside then. Uh, well, let's chat with you. Think but about searching that guy across the street. Maybe he has them, but who knows if he actually worked here? It's worth a shot. Damn, pessimist. How I do end up with them. I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff, and it just made sense. So you're local. You probably knew the owners of this place. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. On the computer? No, just doing my own thing. Good. What about you? Live your life how you want, man. Um. Yeah, I grew up, I grew up here. here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh, so you probably knew the owners then? Yeah, I did. Good people. So, trust us that we know that guy. We proved that that guy worked here, and then we can try to clear the street to search him for the keys. Yeah, probably easier said than done. That's your brother, man. Uh, do you, think, you we're think we're safe? Here? I don't think we are. Well, I haven't been able to get through this gate so far. And the drugstore's safe enough, I think. Whoever owned it took good care of it. It's well stocked and locks up well. Yep, that's my family. What's everyone like in there? Oh, well, Carly's pretty nice, you know. <laughs> Dibs. Yeah. Lily doesn't take any crap. She's been running the show, keeping people on watch, things like that. And her dad. Yeah, it's the muscle. That guy. He's kind of a dick. <laughs> Pardon my French. I like you. But you don't have a gun, which 
doesn't make you very we useful. Think about Let me check him now. I mean, admit, he's my brother. Maybe he has them, but who knows if he actually worked here? He's my brother. God damn it! I know he worked here. Fine, let's go back let's inside. Let's head back inside. Okay. Asshole. Surely we would know the combination, because this is our story, correct? Okay, so we've talked to you. We've talked to Carly. I got dibs. Remember that, Doug. We uh, can't ooh. let anything happen to Ducky. I know, hon. Batteries. Boom. Who wants a radio working? Okay. Oh, what? What? No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead cards. Witty, witty Lee. I I like you. You are witty. That joke was very disgusting, but amazing. This battery, battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. But that's only one. <laughs> I'm still looking for batteries for that day. Thanks, I appreciate it. Okay. Mmm, om nom nom nom. Energy bar. This will come in useful. For Clementine. Yes. Cheer up. Uh, let's talk to you first and then I'll give you treats. Hey there. Hi. Can I get Can you anything? I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. Hmm. I'll see about that. We should get to so, know each other. Um, are you okay? What? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I mean, I, just, I did almost uh, get you killed. I'm good. That's good. I'm not very good at this, yeah, Lee. I, I think so. Uh, being good is good, despite the circumstances. <sighs> Lee. Yep. You're not very good at this. <laughs> Any word from Glenn? Parenting. Nothing. Hardest is thing okay? in the world. Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. We'll sit tight. Yep. Uh, okay. I have food for you, though. Eat. Not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. I'm here. <laughs> he looked up like, yeah! I'm an awesome person. Examinate him. Can we cash it? be good, though. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. Except everyone you know and love is deadly. Oh, another battery. Okay. Okay. Let the radio. Oh, another energy bar. Just gonna keep feeding Clem. I'm not going to have her run out of energy anytime soon. Can I feed you more? I can't feed you more, but I can talk to you again. Let's see. Are you okay? We never know. It might be Everything something new. Okay. Mhm. Mm Good. Well, that was not awkward at all. Moving on. Do do do. Here's your other battery. And here's another one. Should be able to get it to work now. Yep. So uh, do it. Let me have a look at that thing. Go Be ahead. Because you don't know how to put batteries into. <sighs> Fine. I'll do it. Okay. Batteries are in. Okay. Let's flip it around. It's not gonna work, I just know it. Come on. Nothing. That's because the volume isn't up. No, no, I want the volume up. AM and FM. Can't touch it, can't touch tuning. Nothing. Hmm. Hmm. Well, this was a failed plan from the start, I suppose. Oh, wait. That was noise. Now? Nope. Nothing. Well, I give up. It was never going to work. Yeah, I'll keep trying. Yeah. Sorry, give Carly. It a try. I let you down. But not a furnace. I'm only using you for your gun. I'm not gonna lie. We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll okay. do our damnedest. Yes. That's a good idea. Uh, let's check you for bites. Hey Lee, Let's talk to everyone. Maybe punching him wasn't such a good <laughs> idea. There were worse plans. Uh, Says the guy who didn't get punched in the mouth. 
Anyway, we, Cat and I, appreciate your support. It's hardly my Thank fault you, you can't take it. <laughs> okay, so, um, are you okay? You guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. How's Duck doing? He's okay. Check. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? Um... She's good. She's good, I think. Yeah. She's a tough one right no, there. So She's just dead. a little girl, Ken. Be harsh. Are you saying, Lee, she spent days surviving on her own? Yeah. That's right. Not just any little girl Better than us. that. Nope. She's the main character. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? Yes. yes. That's right. So why are their batteries are they? floating? Should we go looking for them? They own this place. They uh, own this place. They're gone. I think oh, I'm too easy to Cat. tell them they my story. <laughs> I wasn't around much, but yeah. Because we were arrested. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Don't be telling nobody that you work here. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. I panicked, you know. Yeah, that's fine. I'm not proud of it. It happens, it happens, man. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. It's yeah. your own fault. That's rough. That shit I happens. that boy. We could have saved him together. You didn't have a choice. You think you do when you look back on it, but in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Uh, I console you. Try to let it go. I have no other choice. Seriously, there was no other choice on the screen. I had to console him. Okay, now we talk to these assholes. I cannot talk to those assholes, but more energy bars. These will become essential later in the game, I am sure. Guys, you just have to trust me. The pills are in there. So there's a door there. Door there, therefore I have to go around. Logic says. Why are my bat why are the batteries floating? This game has bugged a little bit. I apologize for anyone who is seeing floating batteries. Okay. Come with me, Clementine, into the bloody office of death and Clem, go back. <laughs> I can't think about them in here. Yes. You must. You must consider this as just another ordinary room, Lee. But I'm going to console you. Don't How you doing? Don't look okay. at her. Talk to her. Yeah. Prick. Everyone out there seem all right to you. Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. Uh, and there was that die. thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. But I saved you. But you stopped it. Yeah, and I did. failed. <laughs> Hello. Can you do that more? Well, I'm not gonna go looking for. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. Just keep out of danger. That Have would be the most helpful. Well? Not in a little while. Well, I'm gonna keep looking around. I've exhausted okay. anything I could say with you. So, um, move the pallet. <laughs> Effort. A cane of beating. What's that? This was my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. See? <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard the dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it. The look cane cool. of beating. Like my dad gave it to me. See, dad's a smart like that. You should keep that hat. Don't ever lose it. Can I take the cane and use it for beating the narrow duels? Take the photo. There's a photo right there. No, 
There we go. I'll get better at the controls soon enough. Ooh. Hey. Well, what a coincidence. It's me. Cheer up, Lee. We have to do this. Find anything? Oh, you just appear out of nowhere, eh? It's a photo of the family who own this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. Shit! You're Lee Everett. Bugs. You're a professor at Athens who killed hey. a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. Fuck. <laughs> I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. I'm gonna kill you. Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? Mm, no, no, I didn't. Stick it Sorry. For a reason. Don't give me that look. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good, because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll I'm just keep it to end myself. your life, woman. How can I trust you, though? How can I trust you? You can't, I suppose. But you don't have many other options. You okay, the ball's in your court. For now. But soon enough, I'll get my revenge. It's the first aid kit. I'm going to open you. You might have useful things. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. F for now, Lee, but, um... You never know what could occur. Alright. Let's move the desk! Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Teamwork. Sure. Yes. Let's do this, Lee. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawer. <sighs> One. <sighs> How are things? Anyway. <laughs> Push How the are desk. You doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. You have me to protect you. Okay, here we go. I will never let anyone hurt you. God, she's strong. Do you have kids? No. I don't know. You don't no, have I don't. a family? You're standing on my father's corpse. Uh, what do your parents do? What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor, and my dad is an engineer. Fuck, she wants to be loaded. Jobs. What's your job? I, uh, teach history and writing and things like that. Like, um, social studies? Yeah, like that. Think you about didn't it, answer my question. Bollocks! Just All fucking right, smart. <sighs> She's one smart girl. She saw through it. I'll have to watch her. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Damn it! Do they, like, hate you? I wouldn't blame them. I wouldn't blame them. Why? Did you fight? I fight with my mom sometimes. We get on we well with them, too. didn't fight. We just didn't talk for a while. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. Sorry, right, Lee. I'm here for you. Shit, I've got a bit, uh... I, I killed someone. I, uh, I, can, I can't lie I got them. into a fight once. And what happened? And it ended really badly. After that, I wasn't allowed to talk to my family. That's so sad. I'm gonna be honest with Let's you, Clem. Move this thing. You're the main character. I don't want to make it in. Oh shit! What did we do? <laughs> Fuck it, Lee. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. You idiot. A little. It's all your fault, Lee. It's all right. We have a first aid kit for this. I'll find you a bandage. I came prepared. It's okay. I came prepared for this. Mm -hmm. Wait, there was another one. Wasn't there? Oh, open the. Open the drawer first because it's obviously going to be used. But I want to check for other things. 
Remote control. Search. It's the remote to my dad's TV. And let's take it. You never know when you could get bored. Okay. Search the first aid kit and get a band aid. Or a plaster, if you're all from England. Lee? Yes? Yeah. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll find They'll, us. They'll uh, track They'll us find down. Us. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. Well, we should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Bad news is uh, we have the other uh, walkie talkie. Okay, let's bandage you up. You didn't let me get the band-aid, did you? Or the plaster. Luckily, me. there's nothing I need in here. But, but, plasters for, do I click it? Do I, what do I do? Open the pharmacy door. Uh, the keys are on that zombie out in the street. Okay, well we have a picture to get us in there now. Okay, so I have to poke her in the head. Let's talk to you for a moment. Oh, right, we've already I'm done that. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. Okay. Here you go. Let's have a look at that finger. How? It hurt. Good Let's job, Lee. Do something about it. Okay. Well, it's not broken. I accidentally clicked the right mouse button. So it's people. Let's have a look at that finger. Sorry. <laughs> How? It hurt. Let's see if we can do okay. something about it. We are going to, um, shit, uh, it's plaster then. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. There's nothing else we can do for it. Stay strong, Clem. Brave girl, brave girl. Okay, uh, now let's make sure you're okay. How's your fig? It's okay. Thanks for fixing it. Well, I'm not I'm a doctor. Looking around. Okay. But I am pretty awesome. Okay, so we need to get the keys. They're most likely on the dead guy outside. We are known as a murderer. I do not feel happy that that is no no no. There we are. Want to head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee. Yes. Yeah. You're not bad, right? I, uh, why are you asking me that? Because I that guess lady I'm... said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? No, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. Oh. I'm honest. Was he bad? He I'm was. the bad one. Lee, Lee. Shit happens, okay? We're in the apocalypse. Just, let's move on with our lives. I have an energy bar. <laughs> I have a couple of energy bars. There's, there's another energy bar there. I am stocked with energy can bars. Rest? How can I with those things out there? Stocked with energy bar. Yeah. Here. I wouldn't find it some stuff to eat. Oh, um, thanks. You're welcome. You're Are you up? sure your girl doesn't need it? She's good. I already gave her one. I'm trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. But I want to talk hey to there. you. Hey there. This is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie or whatever? Thanks, this is Glenn. Glenn. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn, we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <laughs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. Don't worry, bro. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? Got your back. I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies, and you got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, got no other choice, man. Got to. Yeah, I'm in. Cool. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Um. 
Not in that skirt is what I want to say first of all. What is that? What are these batteries doing? Whoa, wait. Let's, let's talk to you. Floating batteries, man. How's your finger, Clint? How is it? Good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. It's because we are top. No, I know I'm not your dad. dad. But if you need anything, I'm your guy, okay? Okay. Same. You're my guy? Oh, what? No. <laughs> you know. We're gonna try to take care of each other. Yes. Deal. Because adults are not trustworthy. Okay. Okay. Alright then, I need to take a piss. Uh, can't. Okay then. Hmm. Mm -hmm, mm hmm. What are you? Food Looks box. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. No, we done that, already done that. Um, uh, I'll give you an energy bar, but I'm not allowed. How are we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Yes, I think so. I'm going to end it here, though. However, this recording shall end here, and we shall be back soon for another spine tingling adventure in The Walking Dead. Uh, I hope you guys have a good day. This has been the Idiot's Walk Through The Walking Dead, and ta -ra.